different types of interviews ranging from conversations lasting a few minutes to several formal meetings, sometimes with even more than one interviewer. First in your class, in school, how many in the class? Uh, Twelve. It was a small town. The interview process can allow you to demonstrate that you are the right uh, candidate for the job. So here are my four tips to help you nail that dream job interview. Number one, do your research. The better prepared you are, the more relaxed and comfortable you will be when the big questions begin. Sensei. Ready? Begin. I uh, graduated this year, major in geopolitics, minor in tech. Before the interview, it is a good idea to do some fact finding. Get the position description, check out their website and actually read through it. Have a snoop on their social media profiles and look at what they are doing, who works there and maybe even connect with some of the current employees to find out what it actually is like to work with that organisation. Number two, plan ahead. Get a friend or your family to give you some prep by asking you some interview questions. Even the best salespeople do role play. Something you can add to this is record yourself on video. This is great to see how you look from a body language perspective and to see if you're stumbling with your answers. Another piece of advice is to think about the commute, plan for the traffic, think about what you're going to wear and make sure you dress appropriately for the role. Number three, during the interview. A firm and professional handshake with a smile is important when greeting someone and this really speaks to first impressions. Pay attention to their body language and yours as well as the tonality of the conversation. Hey fellas, that was a good handshake. We got a good one too. It goes like this. Okay, here we go. Oh, how nice you doing, sir? Very good, sir. <laughs> oh, man. Make sure you listen to the questions. Remember, you have two ears and one mouth. Also ask questions for further gain insight whether or not this role is the right one for you. Number four, ending the interview. Just as important as the first impression, so is leaving a lasting impression. Thank them for their time, ask them when they should hear from you next and what the next steps are. Then, when leaving, shake and smile. Also, if you get offered, it's not unreasonable to request a short period of time to consider the offer before formally accepting. If you're looking for more tips or hints about landing that job, visit our social pages or if you want an excellent agency representing you, please give my team at Career Building a call or PM.